So now let's use react.js and for that we are going to use next.js to have the front end of our uploading system where we can show the progress and send the file from react or javascript. So let's go to the documentation and first I'm going to create a new next.js application. Copy this command and go to the terminal and I say uh, not this one yep upload million front this one is simple and while this is installing because I want to use the tailwind CSS just for the designing and it is uh, not mandatory for this project but I'm going to use it so for that I will go to the get started part and on that we have an installation on the installation we have a specifically for next.js okay so let's use that and we have already created the application then we just need to run this command so copy that and we need to just wait for this to complete so now it is done going to close the terminal and i'm going to open this directory front with vs code actually i have to create a new vs code so create a new one and on that i'm going to drag it you can also use the code dot from the command line or choose from file open whatever you want okay so let's open the terminal of integrated terminal of vs code and let's say npm run dev to start the server for our next.js application and you can see this server is started at localhost 3000 let's go to the localhost 3000 here and we can see the simple next.js application which is here okay now as we know we want to use the tailwind so in a new terminal i'm going to run this command while this command is running installing things i will go and see what next we need to do we need to run this command to have the configuration for tailwind and also for the post css like this okay so in a new terminal i can run it while this is running <laughs> let's see next step so it will going to create the tailwind.config.js and on that we need to run or we need to change the purge part it's not mandatory for learning purpose but uh, let's totally skip this thing <laughs> okay so i'm going to skip that but what the most important thing we need to do we need to copy these three lines from here and go to the style global copy everything or delete everything and then paste this thing so see it has already created these two files so post css tailwind css that's done going to close it you can see npm uh, tailwind post css auto prefixer everything is installed so let's close this terminal also here we have the server since we have added these things and we have changed the global css we need to restart the server this is only just for one time okay so once we have done with that if you go and uh, reload this it will going to change all the styling and quickly you can see we have stylings so this page is coming from the index page inside the pages directory so close the terminal on the right sidebar we have a pages directory and we have an index.js for now i'm going to delete everything and i'm going to create a new uh, functional component called index and here i say h1 and let's make this as a react file so that i can have the emit so if i say h1 yep it is completed and hello uh, react next js if i do this and yes you can see it's going to change everything and we have hello react and now i'm going to make this at the center so class name is flex height of a screen and one more div inside i'm going to say class name is margin of auto by doing that you can see it is at the center that means react is now or next js is now with the tailwind css okay so this is done but what we need we need a new uh, page where we can go and uh, upload the file so let's create a new page 
I just say upload.js create a new functional component here called it upload and I just say upload here nothing here. go slash upload and it should give us the upload text yep which is here that means we have this route but we need the navigations so one thing we can do we can have a link tag like this one and this we need to import link from next link like here and then inside this link i'm going to create or simply say home and this is going to have a href of slash because it's a home and slash upload will be for the file uploading so just upload these two links are here so i think we need to style these two links so what i can do i can have these two things into anchor tag so why we have the this uh, yep we have this anchor tag and this anchor tag i'm going to give it some styling and i say margin x of uh, 2 and font of uh, semi bold okay this is just for uh, uh, styling purpose and these classes are for tailwind css if you don't know tailwind you can refer to the documentation it's super easy i can say, say <laughs> this is really easy so these bold links are navigations if i click on home yep i'm right redirected to the home i also want to have these two into the home page but i don't want to repeat myself so i'm going to create a new component so first i'm going to say components and inside components i'm going to create a layouts.js file in this i'm going to create a functional component and i just going to paste it here so here we have these two links after that after that link i'm going to say children why i need to get it from the prop why i'm giving children because i'm going to use this layout here so i say i want the layout like this and let's import it actually this layouts no issues inside this i'm going to move it now if i go and it says link is not defined inside layout okay so import link from uh, next link done yeah so on our home page we also have this uh, home and upload so same we can delete from here and we can say instead of div i need the layouts uh, just by doing this and i don't want this link here inside the uploads just by doing this we now have these two things inside of the uh, every page okay now see this upload text is here and inside home we have at the center so why not move these uh, two divs actually into the layout so this children whatever we put inside this uh, uh, layout we are going to have that thing at the center so just by doing that if i go here you can see yes it is at the center but if i go to the upload that thing also is at the center so for now i'm going to just style these things because this is not a react course or tailwind course so i'm going to style the header and then i'm going to have uh, some uh, upload form at the center inside this and then we are going to start uploading the file 